everyone, welcome to another Minecraft tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you one of the latest features from Minecraft 1.8. Now this, what I'm going to be showing you, now I'm here with my friend Eddie, who's going to be helping me with this video. Uh, say hi. Whoops, I suck at spelling. Say hi. Say hi, come on. Say it. Say it. Say it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Yay! He said hi, everyone. Okay, good. So, I'm going to be showing you how, as you probably know from the title, I'm going to be telling you how to use the spectator mode in Minecraft 1.8. So, I'm just going to start off by showing you the, the command. I'll probably chuck this in the description so you can copy and paste it if you're not good at spelling. Game mode SP, and you just hit enter. The world's gonna go dark, kind of, and uh, you're gonna ram into a wall and go straight through it. Weird, then you're gonna go through the floor by holding shift, and you're gonna go straight through it. Now, my friend cannot actually see me. Can you, oh, you see me, question mark. Can you see me? No, see? So he can't actually see me when I'm in spectator mode, and I cannot interact. I, the little thing in the middle of my screen, the little clicker, um, is not even there at all anymore. It's just, it's gone. And so I cannot interact with anything in my game. So, but some very cool features with um, spectator mode is you can see things through this perspective of other characters. So we're just going to start with Spider. And so I've got this this little mechanism hooked up here, so that when you click the button, yep, spider comes. Okay, now I'm just gonna left click on the spider, and I go into him. Now, uh, punch. Not sword. Okay, so as you can see, he killed me, Dumbo. Do it again. Okay, and so as you can see, I'm seeing the world through the spider. And it's got some weird angled vision, and it's kind of blurry and really confusing, actually. And so I can see everything that he's seeing. Go. Go survival. So I can actually see every... No, I can't move at all. Shift. Shift will just get me out. That's all it can do. Now, I'm running. I don't know why, but the spider seems to want something over in the corner. Okay, um, so, I'm just going to click left shift, and I'll just go out of that animal, and now I'm going to go into this animal. And so, now I'm, that I'm in this animal, you can see that I'm seeing everything in some sort of fragmented vision, where I can, okay, so, my friend's in survival, and so, you can see this epic battle from the eyes of the spider, which is very cool, and so that's one great thing about Okay, so as the the spider character died, I just got kicked straight out of the body, and I'm floating again. So that was great. So as you can see, the spider has a very cool fragmented vision, where you can watch an epic battle in survival by just watching it from the eyes of one of the players. Okay, next up, Creeper. So now he's going to summon a creeper, and I'm just going to go straight in. Now, the first thing you see, it's very, very green. Which I think is quite funny that Mojang did this. Because the creeper, um, can see everything green, which is very interesting, because he looks pretty green as well. Um, so he's just kind of staring at my friend there, and they're just, um, interested in each other. They're looking deep into each other's eyes. But yes, it's very, um, very, it's very green vision, but as you can see, the creeper doesn't do much. He just walks. And is he hunting someone? He's hunting him. Um, so he's, he's hunting. The creeper is hunting. Oh, now he's getting shot. Okay. So as you can see, you can hear everything in the normal game, and you can see everything that creeper says. Okay. Kill it. Everything just looks kind of like dry and washed out 
once you're out of the green vision. Okay, and last but not least is slime. So, slimes, nothing actually happens to your vision, much to your surprise, but it's quite fun being inside a slime, because they jump around a lot, and they twist around a lot, and so I just thought it would be quite funny to, to watch from a slime's perspective. Now, of course, you can do this to any animal in your own server or with your own friends after you've watched the video, because you'll, of course, know how to do it. So, but I just want to show you a few brief things. The last thing I want to show you is that you can actually see things from a player's perspective. Okay, so I'm going to get him to do a spider battle, because I'm inside him, which he finds quite gross, but yes, I, I am inside of him. And now he's going to do a spider battle, and I can see everything from the eyes of him. And if you see the little cross in the middle of the screen, I can left click to switch perspectives. So, as soon as his eye goes on, I can click and switch. Or I can switch out and watch it from a third party sometimes. Okay, so Eddie was slain by a spider. As you can see, I can't pick up any item drops. I'm completely eradicated from the game. Okay, but I can still do commands. Oops. Um, so um, my friend is back for revenge. Okay, so thank you guys for watching. I hope you really enjoyed the video, and see you next time.